Oh dear, Metaton. It's supposed to have Metaton's latest stage performance. A tragic tale of two star-crossed lovers kept apart by the ties of fate. Looks like it's almost time for the performance. Oh dear. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, that's human! <laughs> no! Could it be? <laughs> My one true love! Welcome back, by the way. I know I'm gonna have to cut this one. This is too precious. It's all about love, man! <laughs> Don't kill me. Oh my love, please run away, Monster King forbids your stay, Ogans must live far apart, even if it breaks my heart. Blah. They'll put you in the dungeon. <laughs> Sorry. It'll suck. And then you'll die a lot. Really sad. You're gonna die. Cry, cry, cry. So sad it's happening. This was, this was the worst. Yeah, this is Token Bot now. I'm calling it. And yeah, sorry for my crappy singing. I'm actually not too bad of a singer. If I want to. If I can. If I try. But, um, it's just really weird that, you know, the the words kept appearing before. Like, the, the words were there as soon as the tune was already you know the tune was that was corresponding to that uh word was already gone so i was always slightly off and that that really messes with your rhythm it's not really karaoke that way anyway <laughs> i'm getting sidetracked so sad so sad you are going to the dungeon wild tools <laughs> Oh no, whatever shall I do? My love has been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly, my paramour will surely perish. Oh, heavens have mercy. The horrible colored tile puzzle. Even colored tiles. Tile has its own sadistic function. For example, a green tile sounds a noise, and then you must find a, mo find a monster. Red tiles will actually wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago? That's right, you remember all the rules, don't you? Uh... Great! Then I won't waste your time repeating them! I knew this was come back. This was gonna come back and bite me in the ass. Oh, yeah, and you'd better hurry. Because if you don't get through in 30 seconds... <laughs> you'll be incinerated by these jets of fire! Ha 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 ha! My poor love, I'm so filled with grief, I can't stop laughing. Good luck, darling. Fuck me. I'm not gonna sing it this time. I have no idea what's, what's gonna happen here. Okay. Uh, okay, um, let's keep going this way. No. This doesn't work, this doesn't work, so... Uh, fuck. I don't know what to do. I can! This was... That was a... Oh, I'm so sorry! Looks like you're out of time! Here come the flame, darlings! Uh, flames, darling! <laughs> like, this was a complete fucking dead end. I don't know if I was meant to uh, escape this. They're closing in! They're getting closer! Oh my! Any minute now! <coughs> uh, 
ring. Watch out! I'll save you! I'm hacking into the firewall right now! That's a firewall. Oh no! How could this happen? Fooled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys! But, that's right! I didn't catch that dialogue, and I didn't uh, skip it either. Something else happened there. I think Alphys just uh, interrupted him. Come on, that metal time! Give a party! You'll never be able to defeat us! Not as long as we work together! Your puzzle's over! Now go home and leave us alone! Puzzle? Over? Alphys, darling, what are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound, then you have to fight a monster! Well, darling, that monster... ...is me! <sighs> okay... Here we go, um... We can check and we can yell. Let's check on him. Maybe it's different now. His metal body still renders him invulnerable to attack. This is a darling say goodbye! Is that your phone? You'd better answer it! <laughs> hey, th this is... Th this seems sad, but don't worry! There's one last thing I installed on your phone. You see that yellow button? Go to this phone's act menu and press it. Your phone's act menu is glowing. Yellow. Press the yellow button. The phone is re resonating with a Metatons, with Metatons presence. This is a darling say goodbye. Okay, we are ball sack now. No, press C. Uh. What? No. Is this gonna kill him? Oh! Oh! You've defeated me! <laughs> How can this be? You were stronger than I thought, etc. Whatever. I think he said whatever. Ring. Well, it looks like you beat him! You did a really good, great job out there! All thanks to you. All thanks to you? No. He's a fucking manipulative son of a bitch. If this, if everything here was his plan, uh-uh. Uh-uh, Alphys, you're not gonna get away with this. I know you're, what you're up to. Um, hey, this might sound strange, but can I tell you something? Before I met you, I didn't really, I didn't really like myself very much. For a long time, I felt like a total screw-up. Like, I couldn't do anything without... without ending up letting everyone down. But... Guiding you has made me feel a lot better about myself. So, thanks for helping me help you. Uh, anyway, we're almost to the core. It's just past MTT Resort. Come on, let's finish this. I mean, he could apologize or whatever and we'll have the, you know... Cutesy, romantic, uh, comedy ending or whatever, with the exception that I won't be inv romantically involved with him. Overall, this, you know, love theme is very strange to me. Like, everybody's in love with everybody. I mean, that's fine with those two. And it's fine with, I don't know, people expressing that, but it always comes out, like, out of nowhere. <laughs> And uh, it's always with a human for no good reason. I don't see why Papyrus was in love with me or Elvis, Elvis was in love with me. And I think there was one more guy. And it's not even cl clear who is which gender. Like, I don't know which gender my avatar is. But maybe that's probably that's the point, actually. Let's talk. Hey, it's you again. I forgot what your voice was. Business is excellent here. These two fellas bought all my ice cream. Yay! I've actually sold out of sold out of everything. Sorry. Wait, I still got something for you. A big smile. How about that? Yeah. Okay. F fair enough. Oh hey, we're like taking a rain check on that killing you thing. Like, don't tell Undyne about this, okay? Seems happy. Nice. I'm glad. Oh, that's just back to the stage. Okay. Okay, and this seems important. I want to go to the right first because we haven't been there yet. 
Oh, that's... No, wait. What? So it's just, uh... Yeah. Guess that's just our shortcut. Anyway. Let's see what this is all about. Hey. Go up the creamy alleyway on the right for some great deals. Okay. Let's talk to Sans first. I don't trust this note. Hey. I heard you're going to the core. How about grabbing some dinner with me first? How about yes? Great! Thanks for treating me. Ah, <laughs> uh, this guy. Over here, another shortcut. Alright. Well, here we are. So, the journey's almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey! I know the feeling, buddy. Tough. Uh, though. What is that? Tough. Maybe sometimes it's better to take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got food, drinks, friends. Is what you have to do really worth it? Well, I don't know, dude. I, I don't know my character's backstory. I don't know what's awaiting him uh, in the outside human world, but... The options we had at the beginning in the ruins told me that my character really wanted to um, get out. So, uh, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. Okay. Hey, let me tell you a story. So I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? I sit out there and watch for humans. It's kind of boring. Why things like deep in the forest? There's this huge looking door, and it's perfect for pr practicing knock knock jokes. So one day, I'm knocking them out, like usual. I knock on the door and say knock knock, and suddenly, from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who is there? So naturally, I respond, this is... This is who? This is a very bad joke. <laughs> then... She just howls with laughter. It's like the best joke she's had in a hundred years. So I keep him coming and she keeps laughing. He's the best audience I've ever had. Then, after a dozen of them, she, no she knocks and says, Knock, knock. I say, who's there? Old lady. Old lady who? Oh, I did not know you could yodel. Old lady who? I get it. <laughs> That's not bad. Well, needless to say, this woman was extremely good. We kept yelling, telling each other jokes for hours. Eventually, utterly, the virus gets kind of cranky without his bedtime story. But you told me to come by again, and so I did. And then I did again, and again. It's a thing now, telling bad jokes to the door. It rules. Can't help but wonder if that old lady was our goat mom. And we killed her. And that's the thing that, that's that been hanging over this playthrough this whole time. Since um, the very beginning. Uh, that's the thing. I think the game... I, I mentioned this already. I think the game wanted me to... At least in my first playthrough accidentally kill her because it was an accident and then you know figure everything else out on my own and you know get the other endings later because I heard there are three endings and I'm dead set on one ending and one alone which is actually between the pacifist and the genocide ending like um, the pa pacifist ending is completely uh, I'm completely locked out of it right now because I killed her. But um, I could still get the genocide ending, would I? Although, I don't know. Maybe for the genocide ending, I would have to kill the bosses too. And I don't know if I can go back to do that again. And I don't think... Yeah, that's not possible, I think. But I heard <clears throat> in order to get the genocide ending, the least you have to do is go through all the areas and kill each and every monster in there. And uh, that will, you know, until nothing, you know, no um, 
spawns are happening, and uh, there's like like no random encounters anymore. And that's where you get to the genocide ending. And I won't be able to do that, and I, I don't think I want to either, because, you know. But uh, we're dead set on this middle-of-the-road ending, and uh, we're gonna go with that, obviously. But I'm interested in maybe if Sans is gonna bring up something really, really sad now. <clears throat> One day, though, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked her what was up, and she told me something strange. If a human ever comes to the store, could you please, please promise me something? Watch over them and protect them, will you not? No, I hate making promises. And this woman, I don't even know her name, but... Someone who sincerely likes bad jokes has an integrity you can't. Say no to. Do you get what I'm saying? The promise I made to her. You know what would have happened if she had, hadn't said anything? Buddy. You'd be dead. Where you stand. Hey, look no, bucko. I'm just joking with you. Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Eh, I think I've died like four times or five. Hey, what's that look supposed to mean? Am I wrong? <laughs> yeah, Sans, I always had the impression that there was more to him than, than, you know, the bad jokes. Well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid. Because someone really cares about you. I know. She used to care. Okay. Oh. There's more people in this restaurant. Originally, we dug mazes with puzzles in order to fall human attacks. But now, building things winding and confusing in some awful tradition. You can't go uh, two feet without being up, be, being up to your armpits in puzzles. Interesting. I work at the core. The inside is a maze made of swappable parts. That means we can shuffle the layout at will. Boy, was today a fun day. I sure love puzzles. I'm the resort comedian. I'm very funny. People laugh at my jokes. Now, my son... He wants to be a comedian like his father. But his jokes aren't funny. He tells these awful puns he's an embarrassment to the family. Ha 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 ha. That's not funny. <laughs> Since his mother... What's the weird way of saying father and mother? For a mother passed on, he couldn't stand living at home anymore. So he ran away, I haven't seen him since. I'm a terrible father. Fata. Ha ha ha. That's not funny. Talking to you about this, it's breaking my heart. Ha 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 ha. That's not funny. <laughs> Just, okay. I didn't feel like making up any more voices right now. Anybody else here? Oh, yeah. As I came in, I realized I forgot to make a reservation, but it didn't. I didn't want to look like I messed up, so I kept walking in anyway. Now I'm just kind of consuming dew off this. <laughs> What? <laughs> uh, come again. Of this ficus, which is a plant, I guess. You know, there's lots of free tables. You could just ask if you could have a, a table without a reservation. I'm sure they'll be fine. But, you know, social awkwardness, awkwardness can be a, a crux. Blub blub, you'll have to... Reserve a table to eat here. You'll also need to reserve your chair, your silverware, your food. <coughs> Excuse me. Your... This is where it cuts up. Okay. Oh, I thought I could look at the ledger. Interesting. Okay, so we're in the core already. The relaxing atmosphere of this ho hotel, it fills you with determination. Oops. There we go. 
So Metaton is a huge deal here, apparently. What the hell are you? This elevator goes straight to the capital, but it stopped working. The hotel's doing its best to accommodate everybody stuck here. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna be home tonight. Um, I think there's some cold pizza in my treasure hoard you can heat up. As a slime, I'm outraged. <laughs> As a slime. Yes, we know. The elevator to the city is not working. Because of this incident, rooms are running at a special rate. 200 gold a room. Interested? No. Do let us know if you change your mind. Have a spectacular day. <clears throat> well, I guess we're in this hotel now. Oh, room service. Got my CT? Maybe? No, you don't. <laughs> uh, it's locked from the inside. How do you know that? Oh, room service. Got my cinnamon bun? I know I don't, but let's say yes. No, you don't. What if we had it, though? He is shuffling. Seems like he could put something under the door. Put? No, put. Like, what am I putting under the door? You put a hot dog in front of the door. Ah. A white paw shoots out from under the door. It tries to pull the hot dog into its room, but it keeps pressing down too hard and the hot dog keeps spinning away. Finally succeeds. You hear the grinding of stone. A single hush puppy slides out from under the door. You got a hush puppy. Okay. Unfortunately, none of the other guests want that. Seems busy. Yeah. That's a that's a very poor existence, if you ask me. <laughs> oh well. So this hotel. We haven't talked to this person. Welcome to MTT Resort, Hotland's biggest apartment building turned hotel. Okay. Whether you're here for a night or still live here, MTT Resort prides itself on a great stay. Just passing through. Nice. MTT Resort prizes itself on being passed through. <laughs> What's in here? Ah, welcome to MTD Brand Burger Emporium, home of the Clam Glam Burger. Keep saying Clam Burger for some reason. Sparkle up your day, TM. Why is this person trying to sell me something? This is a hamburger restaurant. I'm just trying to survive. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we have nine gold. That's not gonna do much. So yeah, we have Starfate, Glam Burger, Legendary Hero, Hero Sandwich, and Steak in the Shape of Metaton's Face. Don't ask, please! <laughs> Heal 60 HP, and I don't think we have even, like, that much. Like, that's a little overkill. We have a little over 30, I think, but who knows, if, I, if we were, you know, fighting things, then... Oh my god! It's the face of the devil! Have a spectacular, uh, spectacular day. This guy, he is not well. Okay, core. And this is outside of the hotel. Okay, um, yeah, maybe if I had been killing enemies, I would have leveled up to the point where I needed those. Anyway, ring. Huh? What are they? Nobody else is supposed to be here. Oh well, we can't worry about that now. Click. Oh yes, we can. By the way, that should be the top on the top of our worry list. Ready? This is it. Take the elevator up to the top of the core. Click. Uh, yeah. What about these doors, though? I guess I'll believe you. Elevator isn't working. Yeah, right. Okay. What? My elevator should be working. Well then, go to the right and keep heading up. Uh, yeah, about that. All right, now I just keep heading up. That pit isn't on my map. Forget it. Let's try the left side. Click. I'm wondering, you know. But we haven't seen Papyrus in ages. I'm wondering if he'll show up again. I, I sincerely hope so. Um, and 
I wonder if this is supposed to kind of tie into the fact that we might have killed him in another, you know, timeline, so to speak, while we were fighting him, and that's that's why it would have been gone. But we'll see. Ring. Okay, it's up to El to make it through here, or not. Watch out! Oh, magic pops out of his head. Weird. <clears throat> is this supposed to is this supposed to be like magical orbs or are these just eyes? This is a really weird creature. Magic. Talk, stare, clear mind. Let's check first, as always. This magical mercenary only says magic words. Hocus pocus. Okay. Oh god. Magic whispers arcane swear words. That's not nice. <clears throat> okay, what, what should we do here? Talk. Let's talk to him. Magic interrupts you by chattering to itself. Its gibberish dizzies you. Your defense drops by one. Tinkle, tinkle, hoy! Oh dear. Oh fuck. That is not good. I'm pressing directions, but I think it's either going like the opposite direction or like some completely different direction. It. I wasn't drunk just now. <laughs> that just happened. Oh, we can spare it now. Weird. Okay. Well, that's that close. Why are there so many monsters here? I mean, it's no problem, right? Well, we just got to keep heading forward. Click. What do you not. Why are you not telling me? Come on, Alphys. Like. It's not, I mean, I kind of don't like him for, you know, this whole charade he's been going on. But I don't hate him either, so he could just come clean and he could move on from there. Looks like you can't proceed until you hit the switch. But that, those lasers will activate when you do. Uh, looks like they're coming in this order. Orange, orange, blue. Got it? Move on to the third one. Click. Let's try. Oh god! Okay, I didn't know it was gonna happen this fast, by the way. Ring. Oh my god, are you hurt? I, I'm so sorry, I gave you the wrong order. Oh, yeah, I actually did. Everything's gonna be fine, okay? Let's just keep heading to the right. Focus now. Crossroads, huh? Uh. Try heading to the right. What if I don't follow his direction? Oh shit. Oh no. Night Knight locks the way. <laughs> okay, he definitely has eyes in his chest. And a beak. Um. Night Knight, huh? Wait. Yeah, we can only spam. We can check, sing, and talk. This Megaton mercenary wields the good morning star. Huh. Farewell. What the hell is going on here? Night Knight smashes her morning star. We should heal up actually. Uh, is that all we have? Why do we have two cod glasses? Okay, that actually worked pretty well. We should have. Hmm. Let's eat the instant noodles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, please. I know. It's a joke on Insta. I get it. Move on, please. Ah. <laughs> I get it. Come on, leave me. Let me let me go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I can't finish like all the other dialogues I can uh, move along with uh, one of the buttons, but this one doesn't do it. Okay, not great, but better. Okay. We recovered 8 HP. That was not worth it. Close your eyes. Oh shit. 
Okay, that was actually not too bad. It, it, again, like... Okay, let's sing to it. You sing an old lullaby. Night, night starts to look sleepy. Ah. Farewell. So it's a moon and a sun. Interestingly. Yeah, let's keep singing, I guess. Night, night closes its eyes a bit. Close your eyes. We got sun again. Oh god. Okay. Night Night washes quietly. Keep singing. Night Night falls asleep. There we go. Night Night is snoring. Finally. Okay. So that's one of them. I don't know. Like, there were two shadows though. Ah, uh, are you okay? Why did you turn to the right? Come on. You trust me, don't you? Yeah, sorry, man. I'm not so sure anymore. Yeah, let's see. We have cloudy glasses, but only one of them. Like, I don't know. And not that many healing items. I could really use some help on that. More lasers? Okay, I I won't mess around this time. I'll just deactivate the lasers and get you through. They're, they're not turning off. I can't turn it off, right? It's okay, I have this under control. I'm going to turn off this power for a whole node. Then you can walk across. Okay, go. Click. It's gonna turn on halfway through, I know it. Ring. Oh, wait, stop! The, the power is turning itself back on. Damn it, this is the toaster. I. I'm gonna turn it off again. When it turns off, move a little and then stop. When it turns off, move a little and stop. Okay. Okay? You won't get hurt. Click. Okay. Okay, we can deal with this. There we go. See? I thought it was saying under control. All the things under control. Okay, we get. <laughs> okay, you said. You said. I don't know. This doesn't look like my map at all. I'm sorry, I. I, I have to go. Click. Don't leave me now, man. You got us into this mess. Sort of. The air is filled with the smell of ozone and fills you with determination. Dude, I'm pumped to keep going, but we, we really are out of time. So, uh, thanks for watching. We continue this journey in the next episode. And if it if it kills me, honestly. Uh, this looks very much like finale time, so look forward to that.